Good morning. <laughs> it is a Monday morning, President's Day to be exact. My girls are out of school today. Yay me! <laughs> Sometimes a vacation for the, the kids is a vacation for the mama, okay? And today is one of those days. So I'm doing my hair, coloring it. I've been thinking about different different color option because I want a color that's going to transition well as my hair grows. So with my hair being so blonde and short, as soon as it starts growing, which it grows really fast, it just, it starts to look dingy. So I want to lighten my hair and then, um, I want to find a really good brown rinse, not a dark brown. I want a lighter brown, maybe a bronze that's not going to make me look yellow. So I'm going to have to be on a hunt for that. But in the meantime, we're just going to color it. And the closer I get to the salt and pepper ashy look, I just be wearing my hats. So yeah. And I'm also, I'm trying to debate on what nails I'm going to put on. Let me show y'all. Um, yeah, I got these from Shein. They have some really good prices on their nails. I do like the black tip. The black tips are my favorite. The last pair that I got from them was a black tip nail in love with those nails but i put them on and then i think two days later i did like a deep clean in the bathroom with bleach and all of that and it kind of messed up the nails so sadness so i said i'm going to give these a try i'm also going to eventually reorder some more of those and just have them in my collection but i'm debating if i want to do the black tips or wait on those and just stick with these. These are the Kiss um, Full Coverage Nails. These are the square ones. I do have another kind in my arsenal of nails. So these are like the rounded, rounded ones. Um, but I've worn them in my videos. Actually, in the last might have been the not the last video one of these videos I did um I had on the square tips those actually last the longest I can keep those on for about a week and a half and depending on how I do with my washing dishes and stuff like if I'm more careful or I wear some gloves I can get away with um, wearing them for two weeks my only problem is my nails grow so fast so there's that space in between the glued nail and my actual um, cuticle so I don't like that so I end up starting to pick them off um, clip them down and pluck them and all of that stuff so I'm not sure which one I want to wear but just a little tip those kiss nails I think the longer your well I do know for sure the longer your nails are um, the longer your nails your fake nails will stay on even the press on nails that you do the sticker type if you you know follow the steps really good with making sure your nail is dry and all of that stuff and then you stick the nail on if your nail your own nail is about the same length as the press on nail they can last really long but anyway I'm going to continue my self-care I'm making plans for this week to film a couple of episodes of the almost 40 campaign so you may actually see one of those episodes before you see this vlog so yeah that's what I'm I got going on I hope you have a good one I'm sure this is the very first video of the new vlog so I'm gonna go ahead and say hello and welcome to my channel <laughs> my name is lisa for those who don't know me i'm just here to share my life i am a woman 
I am almost 40, 39 years old to be exact. I am walking closer and closer each day to turning 40 in August. And I just, I want my life to look different than what it has been. So I will be sharing, you know, my aha moments, those growth experiences. You will see all of the awkwardness that I got going on because I am awkward, but I like it. I call them quirks. Um, you will see, you know, some of everything, okay? So yeah, welcome. If you haven't already, please be sure to hit the subscribe button so that our, um, our channel can grow. I welcome you on my journey. I got my little tops here that I'm working, you know, for my, my videos. So getting all that planning together. Anyway, I will talk to you later and I'll see you in the next frame. Okay. All right, so I'm getting ready to get started. Look, this is my little set <laughs> for now. Uh, I keep saying for now because I know things are going to get better. Um, but anyway, this is my behind the scenes. I got my camera ready. I got my lights. I got my little setup back there. Um, I got my stuff on my table for what I need for my first video and my jewelry um, for my other videos. Because listen, if you are a content creator, learn to batch create. Hold on, let me turn you around so we can talk. Okay. Learn to batch create. Okay. Some things you can do multiples in a day. That way all you're doing is you're editing. Um, so you can kind of keep your free up your time, you know, it's less exhausting. So my goal today is to do at least three videos. That's three weeks of these videos because my almost 40 campaign, I want to do every week. I want to upload them um, once a week because I have so many things on my list. That list is ongoing, okay? Even though I haven't been doing them since October, I still, because it's actually my life, you know? These are actually things that I'm doing and not just coming up with for content, you know, I'm just sharing what I'm doing. Um, so I'm, I'm batch creating. That's why I'm keeping my attire simple, black turtleneck. I don't know what I was thinking when I put on makeup and then was thinking about putting on a cream turtleneck. Girl, you want to mess up your shirt. So <laughs> I'm just going to do black turtlenecks and switch up my earrings. Okay. Um, I'm going to stick to my script, but yes, I'm excited. Let's get this going. I hope you like the one that I am posting today, which is Thursday the 24th. So, but anyway, I'm going to go back to doing what I'm doing and I will, you know, see y'all in the next frame, I guess. All right, bye. <laughs> I think we good. Okay, got it adjusted. Ah, okay, let me do this. All right, oh my. Hopefully I don't look, it looks okay. Okay, I don't see a bad glare. Mm -hmm. ah, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Okay, ah, this feels so good. Anyway, let's do this. Mm, mm. <sighs> Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa Latour. And for those who don't know me, um, 
Oh my goodness, I messed up. Okay. Anyway, let's start it over again. <clears throat> One more time. It's been a little while. It's been. A little, I gotta get back into it. Oh. Okay. One hour later. I did it. I don't know how awkward it was. I just. I'm glad I did it. You know. <laughs> First video back, done. I just gotta edit it and put it up. I hope you like it. I hope you like, you know, join me in this growth that I'm doing, you know? Um, and I hope that I get to celebrate your growth experiences too. You know, be sure to comment with what you're doing. I am not that type of person that don't want to see nobody else win because I wants to be, you know, the only one. No, girl, guy, do whatever you, I, I don't, anyway, <laughs> I don't know who's watching, guys, gals, or whoever. If you're doing something, mention it in the comments. Yay, you know, I was talking about the same thing in my vlog or... You know, these are the things that I was talking about with such and such or whatever. Or, you know, in my business, this is what I'm doing. Share it, okay? And I'm going to start doing some um, shameless plugs too under folks' comments. Why not? Why not let people know that you are out here? Um, that's just a part of the game, really. I guess you can call it the game or whatever, but <laughs> you know, I just, I have been really shy about putting myself out there, you know, being consistent on social media is just, it is a big part of it, but also sharing what, um, what I'm doing is also another part of it. I mean, I'm going to start, I'm going to get me a sticker or something to put on my car that says, says, hashtag um almost 40 campaign so that somebody what is hashtag almost 40 campaign and look it up and see all my videos there or something i don't know but i'm doing it i'm going i'm going to work some things out so that i can grow in this you know and i just i hope you grow with me you know thank you so much for watching this vlog I hope you have a good one. If you haven't already, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Specifically subscribe, okay? That's the part. And watch. Come back. Come back. Come back. Okay? Um, and yeah, I just, I look forward to the growth in this. I don't know where this path will lead me to, but I'm just asking God to order my steps and i just i know his vision is much better than mine okay so i'm going i want what he want for me not what specifically what i want because you know my teddy bear might be this small and his might be like this big so i want the big teddy bear and i just want the big teddy bear <laughs> All right, I'm going to drink a little more coffee and prepare for my next video because like I said, batch creating is the business, okay? If you do, you um if you're creating content, find a way to do some batches. When I start going out to do my photo shoots again, it is at least two looks while I'm out there. I'm not going to waste no moments. I'm going to maximize my trips because I'm also a mom and a wife and I have lots of other responsibilities. So, and I don't want to sacrifice my family for a dream. Not doing that. I want it all, okay? I want it all. And God said, I can have it all. It's just my steps may be a little slower. And that's fine with me, okay? As long as I get there. So, y'all have a good one. I look forward to seeing you all next time. <laughs> Bye.
Oh, this battery is dying. That's what it is. Oh, come on now. At least work right now. Okay, bless it. Before I go, this candle, do not, you hear me when I say do not, do not sleep on, oh, it's so hot. Um, <laughs> do not sleep on Walmart candles. This candle is amazing. The juicy watermelon in our bedroom, it smells up the whole room and it is delightful. Like, um, I'm gonna be honest. Hold on, let me turn you around so I can see you. I'm gonna be honest. These Bath and Body Works candles, I like them, like some of them, but there are some, the fragrance in it kind of like, it's suffocating. I don't have, I have not experienced that with this candle. And there's another candle I got from there. Cinnamon something, apple cinnamon or something like that. I did not get this that suffocating feel with that candle either. It's like you still, you get the fresh room feel. You get the nice fragrance. It's not overpowering, but I can... I can be at anywhere in my room and still smell it. Like, oh, delightful. <laughs> uh, anyway, I just had to tell y'all that um, before I completely ended the vlog. You see, I got on these, um, a different pair of earrings because I've done um, a total of three videos today. I accomplished my goal. Amazing candle. I hope you have a good one. I'm off for real, but I had to come back on and tell y'all that because as I was doing my videos, the aroma was just pleasing to my senses, okay? So if you haven't, try that out. Try you a good, like, sm of course, smell it before you take it home because they do have some smells. Uh, I just, I don't like food smells. Um, Unless I'm actually cooking. I don't like food smelling candles. They just, they don't do it for me. But this one, Juicy Watermelon, the Apple Cinnamon one. Um, they got some other ones that I want to try. But Chef's Kiss, amazing candles. But anyway, that's all I wanted to say. You know, I will talk to you later. All right then. Bye. <laughs>